Welcome to the Daily Reminder Network. Dua Revival by Majid Mahmoud. Assalamu alaikum. This is your brother Majid Mahmoud recording for the Daily Reminder. Brothers and sisters, are you in debt? Soon will be or know someone that is? If that's the case, then surely, inshallah, you will find benefit in watching and sharing this video. Are you ready? Bismillah rahman rahim In a sound hadith in Sahih Tirmidhi, a man went to Ali ibn Abi Talib radiallahu an, seeking his assistance and support to pay off a due payment on that man. Ali told him radiallahu an, shall I not teach you some words, a dua basically, which I learned from Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, and don't forget to say sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Had you say these words in this dua, Allah will take care of your debt and will help you and assist you even if that debt is as big as a mountain. Allahu Akbar. Allahu Akbar. A dua, naam. But brothers and sisters, don't rush. You say the dua, you're certain Allah will accept and you need to also take action. Huh? You need to take action, not just say that dua and sleep. So you organize the way you do your payments, you check the things that you need versus the things that you want, and you do all that wisdom, inshallah. May Allah increase our wisdom, Amin Rabbil Alameen. Ali radiallahu anh tells him, say, Qul, say, Allahumma, O oh Allah, ikfini bi halalika an haramik. O oh Allah, help me and suffice me with that which is lawful against that which is unlawful. Basically, O oh Allah, don't make me use the unlawful avenues and resources to pay off my debt, whether it was accepting bribery, stealing people's money, or any other means to take care of my needs. Rather, Ya Allah, make me use the halal, permissible avenues to do so. وَغْنِنِي بِفَضْلِكَ عَنْ سِوَاكَ And O oh Allah, make me independent of everything besides you, Ya Allah. Allahu Akbar, what an amazing dua. Once again, Allahumma ikfini bihalalika an haramik وَغْنِنِي بِفَضْلِكَ عَنْ سِوَاكَ Brothers and sisters, may Allah bless you. And Wallah, just think about it. If Allah provides for those who disbelieve in Him, will He forget about those who testify there's no one worthy of worship except Him? But you need to make dua and be certain Allah will accept and you need to take action. Make sure you know how you organize your stuff in terms of payments and the needs versus the wants and do you really need like the latest phone or the latest TV when you have a lot of loan on you. Just think and use your wisdom inshallah. May Allah bless you. This is our 10th episode and perhaps the last one of the series Dua Revival. I ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala that this series is of benefit to the whole ummah. Ameen Rabbil Alameen. Feel free to like the video. Click here to subscribe to my personal YouTube channel, but don't forget to click share and spread that khair with your friends and family. Barakallah fikum, wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Donate now. Go to www.thedailyreminder.org slash donate and stay updated by joining our network's social links.